and Larry family. So we did this thing today. Yes. What did we do, you guys? We bought four kayaks. We bought kayaks. Instead of us going on a family vacation this year, because of the lockdowns and everything and all the COVID stuff still, we went ahead and decided we are going to go on our local lakes and do a whole bunch of mini vacations or campouts or whatever. And we bought four kayaks. To go to many, many, many locations to find <laughs> different colors. Yep, we ended up getting two that were the same color because that's what we found. But we are heading home now and we'll show you when we get there. Woohoo! All right, y'all, so there they are. We've got um, three that are where your legs go in and one that you sit on top. Cassie, what do you say? Cassie would go kayaking with us. And then we picked up four sets of paddles and a handful of other things. We have life jackets and things like that. So there we go. Hi. Hi, Race Echo. We are going to do tricks with Berlin today. And Grayson. The second I take off my shoes. I messed up that one. I'll try again. <laughs> you can try again. Okay. Wow, good job. Right, hang on, I'm going on, I'm going on. All right. And one last one. Turn the camera to me. Here, hold this, please. Hold All this, right, please. well, the sun's right behind you. Oh, I get a pocket knife. Yeah. Okay. Suck. Yeah. Right. Let's get this fun Crazy started. Move. Boom, boom, boom. You're a goofball. <laughs> All right, so the garden is just about ready. We've got everything burned out of it. So we'll walk down there. <laughs> Loki's been turning the dirt for me because that's what polar bears do. And there he goes into the garden bed. So he's been digging holes for me. We'll refill all these in, um, get everything. It's nice and Nice and pretty out here right now um, in terms of the dirt. This quail house is gonna get moved to the back area. We'll put in another bed, actually we'll probably put in the greenhouse right there. So this bed has been tomatoes in the past. We'll probably change it up this year. Um, when we got great tomatoes this last year. We still gotta turn this bed and refill in. We've got a bunch of manure and stuff he's been <laughs> Pyrenees like to dig he's been digging out my beds for me and we'll just turn and put more into it and then this has been the dump area for like guinea pig um, all the fluff from those cages and a baby chick cages so this all get turned here and then our aquaponics has been taken down so this will all get put back up um, we'll put the aquaponics right here um, eventually getting a solar system and then we've got the new gate going into the goat yard. So the fence on the other side of this has to go away, but the gate is in and all set. So we'll get all that going. And we've got all sorts of babies out there right now. Let's see if I can get, yeah, there they are. So the goats are, I've got some on this side of the fence, some on that side of the fence. So this week after this storm, we had a storm come in. It's actually, the sun's going down now and it's pretty. And then all these old quail houses, we're going to re either repair or get rid of. So all these will be all taken care of, but all this is looking good. So, but the garden is, will be gorgeous. You see there's polar bear, he's gonna, do some more digging there for me. But the garden will be up and going. We'll be planting onions and getting some more garlic in. Um, here shortly, we knew this season we weren't going to be able to do a lot. What are you doing, guys? He's like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just doing a tour of the garden before we get it all planted. Onions going in, garlic going in. Gorgeous girl walking down to say hey. <laughs> so 
yep, we've got to get the greenhouse in. We've got to get the aquaponics back up and running. And then we will have happy areas. What are you two doing? Goofballs. All right, you guys. We'll see you soon.